So this next culminating amazing person um, was uh, seemed like really actually very essential to my idea about what art writing is and what it can be. Um, Dynasty Handbag uses language in ways that I still am wrapping my mind around and hopefully you guys will too. Um, so I'm really, really thankful and excited that um, she's here tonight. Hello, everybody. Oh. oh, yeah. You'll never understand I'll never beat you I'll never lie And if you're careful I'll forgive you by in my God I would die for you If you want me to I would die for you I'm not your lover I'm not your friend I am something that you'll never comprehend no need to worry, no need to cry I'm your Messiah and you I will die for Yeah, I just have a lot of feelings this week. Um, but because I'm an artist, I just get to, um, you know, put them into my work. 
Um, I'm really honored to be here tonight. I don't really understand why I, I use words. I'll use them up. I'll use them up here and down there. Um, I uh, just wanted everyone to know that um, I didn't get a chance to stretch. So um, I'm going to have to do a little bit of that in between. But I'm into transparency and that you know that it's hard on the body, the artist practice. Um, I don't really know what to say. I feel as though, um, you know, I don't really know what it is that I do. So maybe one of you guys can write about it and tell me. That would be great. Um, because I work a lot less hard than I used to because now I usually just do karaoke versions of songs. Um, I did write that last one, though. Uh, it probably sounds a lot like one you've heard, but I did co-opt, regurgitate, bleh. Um, okay, so uh, I feel cathedral in here. I feel, roy I feel holy and royal, and a little echoey and a little weird. I feel vaultish. I feel to me. I feel Vatican-ish. I feel robe-like robe and roby and uh, scroll-ish. I feel scrolly. I feel bearded. I feel oldy and scrolldy and beardy and a little weirdy and comf uncomfortability. But I'm here this evening -y with you all. Uh, I feel -y, my voicey echoing around -y. There's no bar. It's just me and these, the people. Um, so we're all gonna get laid tonight, right? That's the vibe I'm getting in here. It's a real fuck party in here, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, I walked in and I was like, oh, this is going off. <laughs> and then that last amazing explosion happened and I was like, it is, go it is going off in here. It is going off. Um, today, I teach performance art. <laughs> Uh, Cal Arts, and um, one of my students, get this, she pretended like she was a baby, <laughs> a woman, adult baby, and then she sucked on a bottle, but it was like she was sucking a cock. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? There was a lot going on. It was, it was a big gap of dichotomy and I juxtapotanging and all this stuff, and she sucked it, sucked, sucked, sucked it. And then she stopped and she went, don't jizz on me. Whoa, 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 whoa. She got me. I didn't see that one coming. I went, didn't. Um, yeah, so, you know, I think I know, but I don't know. You know what I mean? I think I know. I think... You think you know, but you have no idea. Oh, 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 oh. Um, yeah. <coughs> All right, I'm going to sing another song for you. Um, this is a song I wrote about men. Um, a certain type. You guys good? Stay put. Keep it, keep it together. Keep it tight, as they say. Um, where is that song? I would rather just listen to um, 
Rude Boy by Rihanna, but we're not going to do that just yet. Okay. Hey, um, Ethan, do you, can you make it a little louder? Thanks. Okay. <clears throat> yes, I see you creeping up behind me. Taking up too much space And I hear you louder and louder I wasn't aware that you owned this space <laughs> You are one man You are Some comedy. Uh, are there any um, heterosexuals in the audience tonight? Don't be shy. Any heterosexuals? Good for you, brave man. Um, you guys both. You probably have a different story, but um, probably not actually. Um, I just wanted to know: Was it hard for you to come out? to your parents, that you were straight? Were you like, mom, dad? I'm straight. I'm sorry, I just And then your dad was like, okay, son. Good, that's good, good talking. I, you betcha. And then I'm gonna go, I have, a, I gotta watch 60 minutes. And then your mom was like, it's not that I don't support your lifestyle, it's just that I'm just very worried that you're just gonna be so, so fucking bored. And I just worry for you. And it's just like the same thing. And you just have this like thing mapped out for you. And it's just, it's frightening. It's frightening as a parent. I, I support you. You do whatever you want. But it's just going to be really dull. Your sex life, you don't have any reason to do anything differently. So you just like are going to do what, you know, is already prescribed. So um, I just think that you might want to reconsider this choice. Because life is full of choices and, uh, and abundance that you are privileged to enjoy. And yet, the confinements 
that have been given you, son, really don't explore those very well for, for what we actually, our capacity of the Son, listen, your brain, you use like one and a half percent of it, maybe. Uh, so just consider that. Anyway, um, I'm proud of you though, good job. Speak your truth. Um, lesbians, was it hard for you to come out to your Tom's of Maine deodorant <laughs> and tell it that you need a different kind of relationship? <laughs> One with a more chemical nature. <laughs> this is just not working. Like it just doesn't work. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. It's supposed to do something that it doesn't do. It does not work. The product is, is a failed product. It's like, oh, this car doesn't go. This ship doesn't sail. You know? It just doesn't what, do what it's supposed to do. Yeah, I had to break up with that. But not before I use it all up to the very nub of it. Ah, I put it in there. Ah, I scrape it. Bought a Trader Joe's. Trader, Trader racist. Maybe you've heard of it. Trader weird names of products. Trader, you want some hot sauce? Well, do you want to participate in that? Or some Asian food? Or some snails? Trader Pierre? Trader, Trader's Nuts? Trader, you know, anyway. So I've been trying to write comedy, but that's about as far as I got with that. Uh, yeah, all right. Um, you guys are a great crowd. That's also something you have to say in the stand-up world. You guys are a great crowd. You guys are an amazing group of people. And you make me feel very comfortable. Thank you. Oh, I think I need a chair. Wait, I got it. Are there any artists here tonight? Great. Ah, <laughs> uh, finally, some creative me time. I've been looking forward to this all week. I've got my favorite things and all I need. A nice, clean, white sheet of paper and my five-fingered magic maker, my right hand. Oh, and my pencil. <laughs> Number two is just fine for me. All I have to do now is close my eyes and let my imagination take over. What kind of messages do I want to convey to the world through the visual arts? <laughs> what kind of positive influence but sometimes with a dark side. Do I want my message political? Well, yes, but digestibly humorous as well. I must also put in some pop culture references for irony's sake, that's very popular. Perhaps some references to modernist thinking, some juxtapositions, some deer with fangs. 
definitely tears of blood, bloody tears, mm, balloons, innocence lost, death, dying, rainbows, balloons caught in trees, sarcastic rainbows, bad rainbow, gray bearded rainbows, bearded men, naked men, mm. dirty balls, penises, brown violence, penises, knives, testicles, penises, sex, mm. anal sex, sexual. No nos, sneakers, new sneakers, old sneakers, dirty sneakers, new fashionable, popular fashion, sneakers, fashion, 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 diamonds, gold, skulls, gold, bloody skulls, bloody, bloody gold, footprints, skulls. skulls with diamonds in them, wrap clothing, natural settings, skeletons with, with my unnatural on rivers going into things in them like a lake. With, with a bearded horse, a refrigerator, or sleeping horse queen, queen with of a mustache, England. people, heroin, your ex-girlfriend, addict, a hippie, my ex-girlfriend and your ex-girlfriend, a dream frog, catchers, drinking, with campfires, love, a frog with rubber gay boots on, gay sex, smart caps, blue Paris ribbon, Paris Hilton, a bird on an airplane, uh, uh, smashing limbs, someone's missing glasses, parts, uh, missing limbs, a kangaroo. On severed, a, um, maybe a good looking stick. leg with a hot leg and tight sh- jeans. Really fancy shoe, but like Jimmy no Choo. person like the thigh is severed, thigh cut off, off, sliced, dead. Rap stars, a telephone, lots of rap gold references. Teeth. An ear shaped telephone. Hmm. Hmm. Birthday cake. Birthday. cake. Birthday cakes with shit Unknown on them. Unknown creatures. Made up ones. Made up ones. So many things. So many well, choices. Well, anyway, I better just get to work. Hmm. No ideas yet. Still nothing. Come on, brain. What's in there? Give me a little something. Everybody's waiting. Ooh, ooh. Here comes something. Ooh, it doesn't look good, though. Uh Uh-oh. Oh, good gravy. It's definitely time for some serious meditation. Clearing away the junk. Taking out the trash and... That was an elderly, elderly piece of work, as you can tell by my references. Although, not much has changed in terms of visual art. Now we see a lot of cacti and triangles 
and cats, uh, windows, portraiture, windows, portraiture, cigarettes. Just giving you guys some ideas. Um, all right. Let's see, what else we got here? <clears throat> Sucks, shitty, lame, old, dumb, stupid, asshole, fuck face, fucking shit, cock fuckers, suck shitters. Oh, that was a good one. Nah, you don't deserve it. <laughs> um, all right. Um, yeah, I just, I did, I am start of going into some new, genre, new genres. Have you ever heard of this? New genre. Um, yeah, so I discovered um, in America that um, we have two things in America, country and Western. Anyone? It's like a fucking hilarious joke. Like, all right, whatever. This crowd, you know. Do you ever think you're just too smart? <laughs> I don't. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, I, I wrote this next jam. I was trying to get a hit under my belt. I'm really influenced by the television show Nashville. Um, I love it. I love alcoholics. I love fixing people's problems. I love stardom, I love fame, I love jets, and I love country music. Um, so I'm trying, this one's been in circulation. It's, you wouldn't have heard it much here because this is a very isolated town, LA. Not a lot gets in or out. Just sort of stays under this weird shield, this cloud of, I don't know, fronds. Um, Anyway, yeah, so um, I, uh, I met a girl. <laughs> I met a girl, and um, yeah, it's just a lot of feelings come up around that, you know? You don't want to be vulnerable, but you really want to get some. So, um, yeah, you just start thinking about it, and it's just a great place to be, you know, when you're just like in that dreamy place of just desire and fantasia. <laughs> um, it's great to be human, right? Um, so it's an homage to that state of mind. Uh, I think some people call it limerence. Um, actually, limerence is when you already, when, you, when you're fucking though, right? Anyone? You're already, you're already fucking, right? Right, does anybody know? Huh, hey, anyone? Huh? All right, that's fine. Look it up. Don't you wish there was a way we could just look things up easily instead of having to carry around this encyclopedia everywhere? It's so frustrating. What was that film from 19... Who won the Oscar? Anyway, here we go. I said I can't stop thinking about having sex with you, girl. I said I can't stop thinking about having sex with you, girl. Relationship and you're gonna be like, can you 
walk my dog while I'm out of town. Can you go to the store on your way over and pick me up some half an hour? Can you get me from the airport? Oh, what about Thanksgiving? Every year I go to Thanksgiving. Can you come with me? Oh, please. It'll be fine. We get our own bedroom. We'll sleep in the Mason's room. It'll be comfortable. It's gonna love you. Wait a minute. If I got to do that for you, and you got to do that for me. Um, what if you don't want to do that for me? Huh? What about that? What does that mean about me? What does that say about me? What does that say about me? whatever I want, except for a reality, I have a fear of intimacy. <laughs> but I'm aware of my problem, and that's the first step in fixing it. And I'm just doing the best that I can. All right, thanks, you guys. That's it for me. Thank you for having me. Thank you, Latia. Thank you, Ethan. Thank you, writers and readers and lovers of art and otherwise. I'll leave you with an exit song. Do you want that? Do you like that? Seems like there's some a missing element. You know, maybe we need some. Let's see what would be a good song for us. Oh, I got it. Does this sound good? Is this good? No, not quite right. Exactly. You know, maybe, I don't know. Are you guys feeling father figure tonight or are you feeling... Um, hmm, let's see. Uh, that feels pretty good, actually. I don't know, you guys. Uh, 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 uh. Daddy, I'm your mommy, baby. Daddy, daddy, I'm a daddy. You're my baby. Baby, baby, baby. Baby. Or what about this? Are you feeling more like this? Oh, right, because you guys are all going to go. Are you guys feeling a little, like, more like this? Eh, 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 eh. Come and rule, boy, boy. Oh, I know what, I know what to do. Come and rule, boy, boy. I know what to do. Take it, take it, baby, baby. What's this? No. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Just enjoy. Just sit and enjoy for a moment. I love the colorful clothes. That organ. She's already working on my brain. Thank you. 